All right, YouTube, here I am, here for the Jamaican tag. You're probably looking at me and saying, she's not Jamaican. Well, um, I'm half Jamaican. I'm Jamaican. Half white, half Jamaican. Um, I was born in the United States. Um, but I was raised totally Jamaican. Um, Jamaican neighborhood, Jamaican family, Jamaican food, you name it. That's what I know. I didn't even know the white side of me. So, I'm here to do Jamaican tag. I, I could answer it just like anybody else. Um, I'm going to try not to... I mean, if the patwa comes out, it come, you know, it's going to come out. But, I mean, everybody else is doing it, so why not? Um, first question. When's the last time I was in Jamaica? Last month. Um, I actually just came back. I got married in Jamaica, in Montego Bay. Um, it was my husband's second time coming to Jamaica, and he was shocked. You know, in, when you hear it on TV, you hear, say, Jamaica this, Jamaica that. And when you go down there, it's a total different story. So, no, I want to move down there. But, not happening anytime soon. So, yeah, last month, I, I got married March 12th. And I'm back now. Married woman. Um, my favorite Jamaican dish. Um, I'm going to say stew peas and rice. This, that's my favorite. Yeah, I like I like everything. I can saltfish, kalalu, and saltfish, uh, oxtail, curry goat, curry chicken. Yes, but soup is on rice and red bean soup, fish soup. Uh, mm, yeah, soup is on rice is the favorite though, with the pigtail and the salt beef. Um, next question. Uh, what household item best resembles your culture? Well, uh, the best <laughs> detail, the, the disinfectant. Any, anything on my mother have to clean, a detail she use. Toilet, detail. Bathtub, detail. Clothes, detail. Anything. So detail would be the one we remember the most. Um, Doggy pot. Food item. Lorry seasoning salt. So we have curry powder. Um, Nutriment, <laughs> well, hard dough bread, really beef. I mean, there's several. Um, not in my house because my husband American and I know nothing about that. But so several things will remind me of my culture and I miss it. Um, say something in Jamaican dialect. Well, I've been doing that for the past two minutes, so you've heard it. What part of Jamaica are you from? No, as I said, I'm not from Jamaica. My mama is. I am from the Bronx. Might as well call that little Jamaica. <laughs> White Plains Road on 238th Street. Um, but no, my mama is from St. Anne, um, country. And, well, the whole family, St. Anne. So it's very country where she's from. And it's not Kingston, but you are three hours from Kingston, about half an hour and a half from Ottawa. So a long time. But since we go a country, about. Mm, 10 years since I go back so because they're not even have a road trip drive plan so it no makes sense to go down there just for go for vacation so if I go for a vacation I'm Antigua Bay or uh, Ocho Rio it's been a good country um but yeah before that every year of my life I go to Jamaica every single year for at least a month in the summertime I go to Jamaica from the time I born to the time about 12 when my grandmother come up here to come live with us um well no what do you love most about the culture? What I can say I love most about the Jamaican culture is the pride. Everybody loves it in Jamaica. You never meet a Jamaica where, where she is in Jamaica. And you, once you ask them, they're proud. Um, you, you see they track, meet them, how they come with them, big flag and green and, every, green and gold everywhere. So that's the, I guess that's the thing that stands out to me the most, that proudness of the people. You know, you have the other islands where you know, know if it's, I think they must have more people on where you know, but it's more you know, not as we big, what we look about we big. <laughs> so that that thing that's the biggest thing is the the proudness of the culture and and not to offend anybody, but it seems like other cultures want to be Jamaican. You have the people them where uh, are rapping at patwa. I mean, I mentioned no names, but you know who I talk about. The female rappers where I use Patwana then song. None of them are Jamaican, but 
yeah, you, you know, as you, you want your Emilia do you like. Um, well, I guess that's it. I did the tag. Um, yes, I'm Jamaican. I'm Jamaican or white, but like I said, I can't claim the white side of me because I wasn't raised white. Um, you can't can't judge your book by its cover. Yes, I I mean, and as you probably saw in other Jamaican tags, Jamaicans come in all colors, all sizes. Um, but what makes you Jamaican is your culture. It's not the way you look, um, not even the way you talk, because there's some people who can't, well, I don't know anybody, but I'm pretty sure there's some people who can't, can't talk in Patois, but they're Jamaican and they were raised by Jamaicans, and that's what they are. So yeah, it's not, it's not how you look, it's how you were raised. Um, and I was raised Jamaican, and I consider myself a Jamaican. If you ask me, but not saying it's my wife, if you ask me, I'm Jamaican. So, hope you enjoyed my tag. Um, do you have any other questions? Thanks.